This Beyond Clean Articles on the Go feature is titled Results. How long should you have to work in an industry before you can express an opinion about it? Written by Hank Balch, founder and president of Beyond Clean. Some people say they have 20 years experience, when in reality, they have one year's experience repeated 20 times. Stephen M. R. Covey to Richie Norton, when Norton asked if he was too young to train older executives for Covey. The Experience Plus Opinion poll closed yesterday, with a whopping 198 respondents and 53% saying that time served doesn't matter when it comes to being entitled to an opinion about the industry in which you work. Want my opinion? Anyone who knows me personally will tell you about my fanaticism when it comes to two things, merit and speed. I work this way. I run hashtag sterile processing departments this way. I hire, fire, promote, and mentor this way. I lift up people whose work product deserves it, merit, regardless of how long they have been in the industry, speed. You can imagine my personal shock when I first realized a few years ago that everyone in my industry didn't feel the same way, 47% according to this most recent poll. You can guess my frustration when, having experienced rapid career growth and sustained success of my own, I was told I hadn't been in the industry long enough to have an opinion. Do what? Says who? I have learned many reasons for the disagreements on this topic in the years since, and even in some of the comments shared on this poll. Different perspective exists on the value of fresh eyes in our departments, as well as the importance of gaining a truly informed opinion before you share it. These different perspectives are important. They matter. And the answer to this is not as cut and dry as I might have imagined a decade ago. All this being said, I do believe that the closer our industry moves toward rewarding merit and speed first and foremost, the more of it we will see in our frontline technicians, leaders, and innovators. The more we listen to new voices and outside perspectives, the better equipped our industry will become to handle the changing world around us. On the other hand, the harder we make it for individuals to grow and gain a platform for their opinions, the less likely they will be to engage in the future. Wherever you land on this spectrum, I challenge you to encourage your teams, organizations, and companies to be willing to speak up. And more importantly, I challenge you to be willing to listen.